Hi friends, uh, in this video I'll show you how to create custom ribbon tab. While preparing reports, there are specific tools you need from different tabs and finding them every time is time consuming. So why not create a custom tab that has all the tools you want and I'll, in this tutorial I will show you how to do so. Here you can see this is mine, fab and now uh, let's begin. For this you know go to options and uh, custom ribbon you click on this uh, this will not okay here uh, at the bottom you can see new group and new tab you can either create group or tab or script create okay rename it plus rename it uh, I'll call it uh, um, frequently used I think frequently used uh, for reports general reports uh, not for all types of reports so general reports again uh, just this is very simple just drag and drop it out there drag I need, think I need font and uh, I think a paragraph so I'm dragging the paragraph uh, from different tabs so you can drag uh, different one what uh, which one you want to uh, one this you can remove this one actually don't I don't need a group if you want then you can create it okay I need I think I need uh, bases and then this one too okay and the headers and the mush. okay this one for be mush and I don't think I need uh, any of from the insert okay let's go to this different design I don't think anything I need from this one so close it wrap it out from page layout you need to page setup a lot of time if you have when you have uh, different paper sizes or orientations okay and uh, um, references I think you need a table of contents and uh, uh, captions and, 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 and uh, you can see now uh, if you don't know what uh, is inside then you can click and know I think it's done. Okay, here in the second tab you have the useful frequently used ones, and uh, here you have all the tabs you need. You can change the position too of the tab on the ribbon. Uh, I can change it to first or to the last, uh, as this uh, as the built-in tabs. Okay, let's do it. Let's further again, you go to the custom ribbon and just drag it upwards or downwards where you like. And now it's done. Here yeah, you will have this one. And when you open it, you will have this one. Uh, okay, thank you for watching. And this is a way you can uh, save a lot of time uh, for the making project or doing any Microsoft uh, Office works. Thanks.